So, I thought we'd do a little test here. Let's see. Let's, uh, I want to test, since I got all these different coolant methods, and I was kind of curious, you know, do any of these methods actually work better, or, you know, or whatever. So let's do a little test here, a little anecdotal test. Um, I'm thinking we'll do one block of, uh, flood coolant. We'll do, uh, uh, let's do the through. Coolant, blah blah blah. Let's test the minimum quantity lubricate that costs like 25 bucks. And I guess nothing. Oh, wait, wait, wait. air blast. Just to try to clear the chips, because I'm going to be doing all this in 60, uh, 61. So let's, uh, let's give it a go.
Well, I decided to uh, do nothing because I, on one of the runs, because I forgot to actually hook up this biatch. I take this thing all the time because off because it comes down and gets dangerously close to this little guy there. So, uh, and then that's why I hit the little panic button. But uh, after a half second, I saw that it was cutting and didn't explode right away. I was like, ah, yeah, fuck it. So we just let it run, and uh, so I said, why, why even put air blast in there? So I got uh, four runs, two you just saw, two, I'll put the two other ones in the video right, uh, you know, if I could, actually just watch, go ahead and watch this, uh, watch it right now. So you can see uh, minimum quantity lubrication, I think, really tends to uh, lean well to the um, filmiography aspects of the shit. Uh, but I'll let you guys have a nice little close-up. From, from my eyes, the, there is a little different from nothing, as you, as you want to expect. On the top and the facing, you can see there's like the... It just, it just it doesn't look as good, and I wiped, I wiped all this shit down with uh, a little bit of acetone, so you know, no coolant or anything else to make it look too too ugly but I mean the surface finish looks not terrible but just you can tell it's not as shiny and good in real life comparing the nothing to the to the flood um, but to my eyes the even ghetto blast uh, minimum quantity thing I got going up there seems to produce as good a finish as my eyes can tell compared to the flood. So no wonder uh, people seem to be using that shit a lot. Huh. All right, well here, have some uh, nice pretty videos of um, the shit spinning. Oh shit, I actually almost forgot to compare the uh, three spindle. It, um, uh, as, best, as far best as my eyes can tell, it looks just as good as the minimum quantity, which seems just as good as the flood. I mean, I don't see any better finish. I mean, not like that means anything. Maybe I'm just not, you know, pushing the tools hard enough or, oh, I mean, the through spindle was kind of useless for everything but the facing since I don't got the right kind of collets to make it so it actually shoots down once the spindle gets going. It just fucking flings all your coolant <laughs> where you don't want it uh, on the walls. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I know, it seems like anything but nothing seems pretty good, at least for this anecdotal test that means nothing. So, here's some beauty shots.